Hello my lovely crafters, this is Crafty Sue 519 Welcome to my channel. And to all my returning subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. So appreciate you coming over and commenting on my videos. And to anyone who may be new, I hope you enjoy my channel and that you subscribe and stick around for a long, long time. Alrighty, this is my Saturday mishmash. And today I have Happy Mail. I have a small haul and another hat I made. I'm in a hat craze. <laughs> Alrighty, let's start off with this Happy Mail. And this is a surprise. It was It's from Bridget Murray. I opened the edge. I really haven't looked at this yet, so let's see what she sent. Oh, look. Oh, it's a pretty butterfly calendar. Look at Bridget is such a wonderful subscriber. She comments all the time. Thank you, Bridget. I love it. And it's my favorite monarch butterfly right on the front. Love it. Thank you so much. Oh, look. Oh, this is a cool idea. She made an envelope and then made it like a pocket envelope. Very cool. Aw. Oh. Oh, look. It says thank you. Look at the beautiful butterflies and the little nouveau dot drops that are on there. Can you see? So pretty. Let me see what it says. Oh, she's so sweet. She's just thanking me for her, the prize package that she won in one of my giveaways. So sweet. Thank you so much, Bridget. I so appreciate you. Oh, look. Butterfly stamp. I gotta take it out. If I can find the end. Here it is. You see that? Look how pretty that is. Butterfly with the music notes. And this is beautiful dream and elegant life with a pretty butterfly. Oh, you could color that in too. Very pretty. And look at that. That's a pretty border on a card. Love it. Love it, love it. Thank you so much, Bridget. You didn't have to do this. You didn't have to. Very, very pretty, and I like your envelope, and I can reuse this. This is very cool. Very shiny. Very nice. Thank you, Bridget. I so appreciate that, and I so appreciate you for watching my videos and commenting. It means a lot to me. Alrighty. I did a little haul from Spellbinders. And I don't know how many of you go over to Spellbinders, but they have these clearance sales all the time. And you can pick up some really cool stuff for a dollar or two dollars or three dollars. They have all different, different um, prices. But I like to stick in the one dollar and two dollar items. I don't go up above that too often. If I see something I think I might be able to use. So, let's see where we start. I got these two rolls of twine, a black. I don't didn't have black in my stash. And this pretty blue, it's called Beach Breeze. And this is called Black Licorice. Oh, I love black licorice. Love it, love it. The only thing with this is I'm a little, I only paid a dollar, so they're not expensive. But they're thin which I'm sure will come in handy on some things, but it's a lot thinner than my other twines that I use. But a lot of times I like to use this to put little bows on stuff and everything, so happy with those. Then I got a pack, a little pack of flowers. I didn't have any of these this size, and I love the colors. My color green, 
in this pretty dark pink and a gray. Beautiful colors. I like it a lot. I think they're trying to get rid of all of their fun Stamper Journey stuff, so they put it on sale really, really cheap. A dollar for those things. And then I got this really pretty sage color ribbon. It's 20 yards in this. And I don't remember what I paid, and the sheet doesn't tell me what I paid, but it's got to be maybe $2 for this, but I love it. It's so pretty. My color... My color. Now, these I know I paid a dollar for. And I buy these tassels when they have them on sale. And I put them in a box that I put aside for giveaways. And that's what I'll probably do with these, too, is put them in a giveaway someday. But for a dollar, they're really pretty. And they're leather, I believe. Aren't they pretty? Silver and... uh. Kind of like an off-white. Very nice. Very nice. And this was a dollar, and it was some Halloween goodies. It's got a little bling and some stickers. and Could have used a couple of these this past Halloween. So I'll add these to my Halloween stash for next year. Can't lose for a dollar. And look at these pom-poms. I know it said mini pom-poms, but I didn't realize how many they would be. These are so tiny. So, so tiny. But I'm sure they'll come in handy at some point. I just started buying pom-poms because I didn't have any in my stash. But I think they're very cute. Very cute. Lots of colors. We'll find something to do with that. And then I got this confetti sparkle. It's like, you know, something you would add to a shaker. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, so pretty. And these things stick to everything. When I make shakers and put these, look at my table now. When I make shakers and I put this stuff in shakers, I always rub my powder bag over the acetate so they won't stick. Helps. It helps. A little tip for you. And then I got these sequins. These were a dollar, I believe. Look how pretty these are. Such pretty colors. Isn't that cool? Oops. Dropped a couple. Oh, they're sticking to me too. All that static drives me crazy. I don't know. I'm a staticky person. I'll tell you. Every time that my dogs want to go outside, I go to the patio door and I get shocked every single time I touch that door. I don't know what it is. Nobody else gets it, but I do every single time. And then my big buy I spent a whole $3 on was fringe scissors. I got fringe scissors. I've always wanted a pair of these, but they were always so expensive. And I didn't know how often I'd use them, but for $3, I could make my own tassels and not have to cut up all the stuff myself. Isn't that awesome? Three bucks, fringe scissors. So, I know they're still having sales right now. So, if you want to see what you can get for a dollar, head on over to spellbinders.com. And they have some pretty good sales going on. And that was my little haul for this week. Well, you all know I've been making hats for my family for Christmas. So, my son here, I had made this hat for my son in Rhode Island. And I think it's really nice. And I thought he would like the colors, the black, the grays, and the whites. But then I made this hat for my other son in Rhode Island. And my husband and my son here love this hat. I even love this hat. I think it came out awesome. So Josh, my son here, said, Mom, I think Jay would like a hat like that better than the one, this one that you made him. I think he'd like it better. 
So I said, oh, all right, I'll make another hat. So I made him a blue one like this. And I put the little gray stripe in it. So I guess I'm gonna send him both. Because what am I gonna do with the extra hat? So he'll luck out. And he can, like I said before, I don't care if they just use it out in the yard to shovel snow or whatever they have to do out there. But it'll keep them nice and warm. So we'll review my hats that I've made. I made that one for Jay and this one for Jay. This one's for Jeff. This one's for my grandson, JJ. This one is for my granddaughter, Alexis. This really stretches. It may seem small, but it really stretches. The design on it really stretches. I love these colors. Love it, love it. I hope she does. I made this one for my daughter-in-law. Her favorite color is purple. And then, of course, I made this one for Vic, my ex-husband. So, those are the hats that I'm going to travel up to New England this year. And that's it. want to remind you that I'm going to do another giveaway with this stamp set and die set. It's beautiful. Absolutely love this. After, I can't wait for after the holidays because I'm way into Christmas right now. So when I'm done with my, my Christmas stuff, I'm going right to this to make stuff. But I'm going to give this away. It's a $60 value. And I'm waiting to hit 600 subscribers. When I get to 600 subscribers, I will do this giveaway. And I'm at 588 right now. A couple days ago, I was at 590. Yesterday, I was 587. You know how it is. You're up and down, up and down, up and down. But not that many to go. So once I hit 600, we'll do another giveaway. I'm also doing a giveaway on my Pinkalicious Collab. So check that out. That's a $20 payment into your PayPal account. And... All you have to do is watch my videos and comment to be eligible for that. So check out my Pinkalicious collab videos. And let's see, anything else, anything else, anything else? Nope, I think that's it for now. I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful Saturday and a very blessed Sunday. And until next time, love yous. Bye.